Hey guys, Rick from Sonus here, back with our video. So we got a few suggestions to make a drop like Chami. So in today's video, we're gonna break down his style. Like we did in Ajay. Ghost. And Proud. So in my opinion, the Chami drop consists of vocals, vocal chops, a lot of shakers, percussion fills, and a long bass line. So let's dive into it. For the vocals, head over to Splice. I always check the new releases for the new vocal packs. I found this vocal pack quite a while ago. So scroll all the way down to here. This one. Let's check out the pack. This drop sounds really dope. Let's search for a vocal in the same key. Sort by time to find the verses because the verses stands to be the longest part in the packs. So now let's check out a few vocals. This one actually matches the vibe we're looking for. Let's go for this one. Mixing wise, we're only shifted down the format a little bit. So now let's add a focus chop sample and add some more effects. So now let's write the chords. We're starting with the bottom notes. We're gonna start off the progression with the root notes and build it from here. Sounding like this. So now let's turn it in a full progression. Strum it and randomize it for a more organic sound. Altogether, sounding like this. For the bass sound, we'll be tweaking this preset from Future Selection Form 3. First, let's bump out the unisons. Then route the LFO and envelope to the detune, which makes it sound way more prettier. We copied over the root notes of the chords, sounding like this. So now let's dive into the mixing. So now let's dive into the drums. We're starting off with a sample Chami kick. Then add a clap at every second and fourth kick. To add more groove, we'll be adding this clap between every last clap of the bar. We also made a small clap fill. So now let's add a shaker loops. I use loops because they sound way more organic. Just open up the stereo separation. Now let's add a second one. Sounding like this. Together they sound like this. Now we're gonna make the percussion fill. Starting off with this percussion. Place it right here. Now let's add a second one. Drop it right here. The last percussion sound like this. Drop it right there. Now let's add a lot of reverb. Altogether, the drums sound like this. Now let's dive into the ARP sound. Copy over the chords and the serum. Now arpeggiate the chords. Now select a plug preset in Serum. Sounding like this. Now we're gonna create a washout effect for the macros. Write it to the sustain, cut off, reverb and delay.
together giving this effect. Now let's add some effects. Mistakes that we automated, the macro washout. Now let's fill it up some more. We need to look for a vocal tone, like this one. We looped it. So now let's mix it some more. Now let's add some more effects like this bird and vinyl sound. So that's it for the video. Now let's listen to the final result. If you like the video, please leave a like. See more and the subscribe button. And I'll see y'all in the next videos.